Hey guys, I'm back with a quick video. Sorry if this is really shaky. I'm not really sure how I'm going to do this without shaking here. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> I have the TV on background. Sorry about that too. Um, and you'll hear my bird, my dove, and my turtle. So just beware. Um, I have a quick candle and wax melt empties for you. Um, I need to find a better, gosh, this is awful because I, my hand is shaking for some reason. Um, I ate, so I know it's not that, <laughs> I don't know what's going on. So anyways, um, I have a good bit here, so I'm just going to go through them kind of quick. See if I can do this better here and hold my hand steady. What, what can I prop my hand on to hold it steady here? There we go. That's a little better. Okay. So first thing is Dexter um, by Super Tarts. Um, this is a kind of old clammy. You can see like the clamps is starting to get soft. Um, Dexter is amazing in a tea light warmer. Uh, it's a great pineapple scent and I really enjoyed it. Uh, I have one more left, but they're, they're getting pretty old. Um, <clears throat> I have Tiffany Candles, Elm Street. Um, it is a Halloween scent, but it's good for this time of year too because it's kind of a caramel. I've got it actually going right now. It's kind of a caramel, um, pumpkin caramel brulee or something, something like that. Um, it's really strong in my bulb warmer. Uh, all the Tiffany stuff has been strong for me, but that one's probably two or three years old and still strong as can be. Um, I just don't really like caramel scents, but it, it's good. If you like caramel scents, you'd love it. Uh, next, Jelly Jam and Dinner Rolls by Super Tarts. This is another really old one, like it's super soft. Um, I did not like this, and only because I did not like the, the jam scent. Um... I don't even know. It's it's kind of strawberry, but I, I don't know. It's just I just don't like it. Um, next, have some. I'm just trying to do the vendor wax real quick first. Um, Peach cobbler by Tiffany Candles. Um, it's just a fruity cobbler scent. It was a couple years old too. It still threw pretty well uh, in my tea light warmer. Um, another Tiffany Candles and butterscotch bread pudding. Had to put this one out because it was disgusting. I don't obviously don't like butterscotch scents either. Um, a bunch of uh, Yankee too. So let's see here. Um, Sugar Skull by Save Your Senses in cotton and candy. Got absolutely no throw from this whatsoever. Um, it's a soy wax melt. I tried it in my bulb warmer. I tried it in my centerpiece. I have not tried these in my um, tea light though, so I need to try it in my tea light warmer because it smells really good on cold. It's kind of like a great cotton candy scent. Um, they're really cute though. They're actually in the shape of little skulls. Um, and it could be because the clamshell was messed up when I got it, or the um, little scent shot thing cup. So that might be why it didn't have really much throw, but uh, another Super Tarts Once Upon a Time in Bell. This was amazing, amazing bakery scent. It's kind of like a, to me, I got like a citrusy bakery scent. Um, it was really good. And I only had to use like a quarter of it to get a really good throw. Uh, what else do I have? Um, another super tart here, sorry. Sorry for my bird. Every time she hears me talk, she starts talking. Um, Slimer, and this was a really, really nice, like lime kind of fruity scent. Super strong, love it. Um, all right, I'll get into some of my other stuff now because I don't think I have any more. Um, bender, I might there might be some in there. Sorry, if there is. Uh, it was an Airwick candle or Air Fresh candle. I actually got this from Dollar Tree in Angel Orchid. Um, it's got a decent throw in the bathroom. It actually, um, it's actually pretty decent in the bathroom. It's nice little air freshener candle. The only thing is these candles go forever, ever, ever, ever. It says 25 hours and doggone, I believe it because it went forever. Um, I have um, an empty 
empty box of tea lights in Mary Marshmallow. Um, they burned well. I didn't have any problems with them, but they didn't have a scent at all. Um, gosh, I have so much stuff in here. Another air fresh candle in Tropical Breeze. Man, this sucker was strong. I'm talking like I was melting it in my bathroom and could smell it all the way through my living room. And this is a pretty long hallway to my bathroom. I mean, it was amazing. And I would just totally repurchase this again. It was another Dollar Tree candle. Um, and it burned, like I said, for hours and hours and hours. Um, a Yankee. Uh, this was a, a votive in vanilla bourbon. Had no scent. Um, Yankee Tart and Marshmallow Chicks. Uh, just a sweet marshmallow scent. It's really old, so it didn't have any scent through. I've got some tea lights I threw in there, too. Uh, this is going to be kind of all over the place because <laughs> I don't have anything organized here. Sensational's Honey Bourbon Frosting, Butter Sugar, and a Touch of Bourbon. Really nice, strong uh, buttercream scent to me with just a little bit of... It actually is not a little bit. It actually has a really strong honey scent to it, too. If you don't like honey, you wouldn't like this. Um, and it also is a little spicy. What else do I have? Come on. Oh, I do have some more vendor wax. Uh, the next thing is Yankee Candle Berry Trifle. Love it. Strong scent. Um, I did it in my Yankee Warmer and it had a nice strong throw. Um, Once Upon a Time in Charming. This again was kind of like a sweet bakery scent to me. I don't know the exact scent description, um, but it was like a, I think a pink wax or red wax. It was really good. Really good. Um, oh Lord. Let's see. Okay. Another Yankee and Autumn Gathering. Oh, love it. I think, I think it has like some patchouli in it and I love patchouli. Um, it's just a nice masculine scent, like fresh scent. Um, it was very good. Very good. It was a newer one, so it threw well. Um, Votive in Berry Pomegranate, if you can see that, sorry. Can't get it to, or Bubbly Pomegranate, sorry. Bubbly Pomegranate. Um, super strong. Just that one little Votive kind of pretty much filled up my living room. Um, Yankee and white chocolate apple and a tart. It was getting old, but it's still through. I enjoyed it. It's like a sweet sugared apple scent. I have another white chocolate apple there. Uh, this. Uh, vintage Chic Scents and Anna Sugar Plum Fairies. Uh, sugar Plum kind of scent there um, with kind of pink sugar plum. Um, didn't really have much of a scent there for me. Let's see. Fresh Cut Roses by Yankee. It's an older tart too, but it always has a good scent there for me. Oh, God. I have so many. Sorry. Beach Flowers. It was super old. Had no throw. Um, Moonlit Garden. It's a newer one. It's still fairly crackly. Um, and it, it had about a medium throw. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad in my little bowl warmer. Come on. What else do I have? Um, um, oh. Chris Morning Air by Yankee. This one was really good. It had a, um, a nice medium to high throw. It was just a fresh, crisp, like, ozone kind of scent. Um, Marshmallow Chicks Votive. Didn't really have much of a scent throw. Twilight by Super Tart, Bella's Blood. One of my favorite Super Tart scents. Super strong. I think, it, I think it's like an apple, uh, sugar, apple. There's something else in it. Uh, I think it's pink sugar and mac apple. It smells amazing. I love it. This one had to go. It's not finished, but it had to go. Sensational's Winter Berries, uh, Cranberry Chutney and Winter Spruce. Did not enjoy that. It was just a fake smelling berry scent. Uh, let's 
see what else I have. Another Save Your Senses in Ursula, which is, um, Ursula was, um, like an ocean scent. Um, it's Ursula from The Little Mermaid, but it really didn't, ha still didn't have much of a throw. And once again, I was too stupid to think about trying it in my two light warmer at the time. Uh, you can get my lavender, if you can see that there. Um, had an okay throw to it, not bad. Almost done here, guys. Another lavender. Let's see. What else do we have? A couple candles here for you. Um, Ginky and Bubbly Pomegranate. Uh, this is a small jar, 3.7 ounce. Burned all the way to the bottom. Nice burn. No problems. Extinguish itself. Smelled amazing. Filled up my bathroom, my hallway. Loved it. I love bub bubbly pomegranate, by the way. Another Yankee in eggnog. Oh my goodness. I loved this candle. It was amazing. It had about a medium throw, but besides that, it was just oh, the best scent, best winter scent. I love it. It's spicy, milky, creamy. <clears throat> it was very good. Um, and it uh, extinguished itself. But it still has a like, punch of it. You see all the oil and the. It's just crazy, all the oil and wax and everything left in it. Very tempted to put on my warmer and try to get the rest of the scent out because I liked it that much. Um, and the last, you know, it's got some junk in it there but it's a yankee candle cranberry oh there's another part what is that one? oh bubbly pomegranate again can you tell that bubbly pomegranate was one of my favorite scents this season um cranberry it burned to the bottom um besides the pieces of wax that are in there the only problem is, is I extinguished it because it got to the bottom and it started um, pretty much like losing its scent. It, I mean, but there's not, there's barely anything left. Um, but it burned really well and it had a nice strong, it actually had a really strong throw uh, for one of their little three wicks that they do at like the outlets. Um, it had a really strong throw for most of the candle. Oh, and I had a Kringle daylight that I just burned the other day in Beechwood and the daylights are the little candles that last about 12 hours I actually think that I extinguished this myself because it wasn't going out and there's like nothing left. Um, it's just a beachy creamy scent I wasn't a fan of the scent but I like the daylights they're actually pretty nice um, I think that's it actually. Uh, yep, that seems to be it. So that's it for my December slash January candle in wax empties. Haven't been home much to melt. I've, the past couple weeks have been melting more than any because I've actually had um, I've actually had uh, time because I finished school. But besides that, uh, I've enjoyed most of the stuff I've melted trying to get through some older wax so you'll probably see some older wax in my next couple of empties and I appreciate you watching if you have any questions or comments leave them down below and I will see you next time bye bye